Hey, what's good everybody? Jay Ping here checking in respectmyregion.com. Here today doing a West Coast Weed Tour review with the man, the myth, the legend, Hyatt's Max. What's good? Good. <laughs> <laughs> so today we're gonna do a review featuring the Nectar Watermelon Cannabis Infused Sparkling Water. So uh, we recently did a review featuring the Orange Cream Sickle flavor, I believe is what it's called, or Orange Cream, forgive me. Uh, this is the watermelon one though. So right. I actually like watermelon waters. Are you a fan? I haven't had one before. They've never had watermelon water. So no. this is your first one. All right, yeah. cool. This is a blind, honest test then. Yeah. Uh, I'm normally a fan, so I feel like a slight bias. Uh, I like the other one. I believe the score that I gave them was around an eight. So I'm okay. expecting good things. Um, is there a lot of THC, little THC? It's a low dose THC, 11 fluid ounces. I believe this is, let's see, what does it say? Um, oh, here we go. 10 milligrams for the bottle. So okay. between you and I, we're gonna drink five each uh, and give it a good test. Manufactured by Space Station, infused by Vertosa. Ingredients, carbonated water, natural flavors, and cannabis oil. And 10 milligrams, THC, zero CBD, manufactured on July 2020. And yeah, so it's delicious. Check it out. Pretty dope. I think it's I think it's wonderful. I'll yeah. let you give it an open. Sure. I am excited to see if it tastes like real watermelon. If it tastes like like bubble gum or some kind of fruity flavor like that, smells good. I'm not gonna really be excited. But if it tastes like actual watermelon, I'm gonna be super pumped. The smell was good. You said the smell was good. All right. And then the way that we do these is it's basically a one like taste one drink review and then the second i like to do a gulp right because if you like something or you don't like something no, a gulp really, is really going to identify that get a good yeah and so color wise this is kind of what we're looking like you guys this um sparkling water we got some good bub bubbles here for carbonation it does smell kind of like candy and you love candy so <laughs> taste the high all right, you ready? Yes, Cheers, brother. Mm. It's a lot less sweet than it smells like it would yeah, be. Yeah, I, I, with, mm, the aftertaste is definitely watermelon. Can you get it now? Now there's that smell, the smell flavor. It smells it's like a Jolly Rancher. It's... I mean, it's actually really good. It's not bad. Yeah, I can I can dig this. It's it's not so sweet when you actually first take it in. The watermelon shines in your mouth after. Like right now after that goal. It's I'm really watermelon. watermelon. Yeah, it's so interesting. I don't. I'm not a sparkling soda person. I like soda. soda. I like real soda. So my <laughs> sugar level is like through the roof, and this doesn't have it. Normally, I wouldn't have been able to take yeah. that gulp, and this like bubbly. What I, I no, that would not have happened. But yeah, this is this is really good. I'm definitely yeah. excited to drink this. I'm here. Let's cheers yeah. again. I'm gonna cheers to nectar. This is a good product. We'll give the final score after we finish it. You ready to kill it? I guess so. It's gonna take me more. It's carbonated. Quicker than that. Yeah. Woo! It's not like too much. But, but it's, it's, definitely, it's definitely a solid amount of carbonation. I just really like the watermelon on it. I think if you were to mix this with real watermelon, you have like the perfect. Oh, you put like a slice of watermelon gosh, in that there. That would be perfect in there, right? Um, when I think of a score out of 10, the only thing that I could really see improving is this plastic outer label. Yeah. To me, uh, it's it looks like it's cut crooked all the way around. It's like... You know what I mean? Like it's it's not there's just not that huge attention to detail on the packaging, but um, I like the bottle. I like the old school dark glass, um, and I think if we can get this to to be more like a craft beverage, like a craft alcohol beverage, like a little IPA or something, I think then it's almost a perfect experience. It's ten milligrams. I like ten milligram products for beverages. I don't typically like to go more than that because. I already smoke a lot. I already dab a lot. So I don't need to be consuming so much all the time. 
Yeah, and this this definitely wouldn't be the drink. I wouldn't get this. The low dose for me is going to be way too low. Yeah, um, but just but, to drink it. But right? just to drink it, and as some just as like a, as an alcohol replacement, as yeah. something to be able to sell at a bar. So would you feel like weird holding this around? You know, around no, people who are drinking. I don't drink alcohol, and this would be something that you would look normal instead of people like. Drink. Like like if like, you just held it like it's this, just like if you're at you a just bar, held it like this, you can't normal. tell. Yeah, you can't tell what I'm drinking, and right? Like, score for me, nine point seven five. The label, I need the upgrade on the label. Everything else, I love. I love on this one. This one is delicious. Watermelon, super fire. I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. Um, I as someone like I didn't finish this, but I wouldn't have been able to even get down the first sip of regular sparkling soda. So this is very impressive. And Solid. Delicious. Solid. And it has CHC in it. It's wonderful. Shout out to Space Station. Shout out to Vertosa. Shout out to Nectar. Watermelon. 9.75. 9.5. Let us know what you think in the comments. Available all over California. Let me know what you guys think. Love you guys. Peace.